Hello you guys and welcome back to episode 9 of my A World of Ice and Fire series. This is a version 2.2, I'm Daily Fix and we're looking at Lucian Oak. Now I had some comments talking about my graphic settings. So um, I, I've tried listening to them. I've turned off the anti-aliasing and I've turned off the HDR mode. Um, if we are getting into a battle and I remember, I will try to turn this one on and, and off and, 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 and wait for your feedback to get it all working the way it is intended to be working without giving you a bloody headache. Now we are currently, we are currently in um, uh, White Harbor and I was doing some off-camera work. And I found a very interesting companion. Yeah, and I'm, I'm sorry about the noise, uh, but uh, man, there, there was something in my ear. <laughs> yeah, very interesting to hear now, didn't it? Well, uh, anyways, look at this guy. Do you still remember the story of you never seen it? Um, but Darren Oak, it's our father. Who would have guessed he was here? So I was like, I, I talked to him and I was like, oh, wait, wait, wait. I got to turn on my recording software. Ah, oh, so I'm sorry, but hey, father, son, it is good to see you, my boy. How are you? It's been about a month or more since last year, since your last visit. Your mother is getting better. The maester says she'll survive a few after a few more weeks of recovery. I'm glad to know you haven't forgotten about your family, and even better that you still remember the trade routes I told you before you left the twins. Man, so good to see you. Ah, now this is very, I know this is very, very tiny, uh, but I, there was no other way to put it in. <laughs> I'm glad to know mother is doing better. As for me, I can only stand to improve my fortunes. I've been using the route you've told me about uh, for trading salts and furs. You were right about them. They've been giving me a good amount of gold, alas. There were times bandit and outlaw attacked us. We mostly fought them off, but we lost a good number of men. Well, I'm proud to know you did not become some heartless bastard who knew nothing but to count coins and stock. Ever since Helen got sick, I've been working with the Maces to ensure she was recovering and as comfortable as she can get. Without Helen to help raise you, you probably would have become too serious for your own good. Father, it was great to reminisce and retell my adventures with you, but I need you to come with me. Of course, my boy. I miss the old days of traveling around Restless. Your mother will be fine without me. And she would understand my decision, but stay here for a few more days and talk to your mother. She would feel a thousand times better seeing you in the Hoken flesh. <laughs> uh, and then he needs money. And then he asks me for money. Ah, oh, Dad, come on. You with your persuasive power over me. Not cool, man, not cool. So... Uh, we got our father in that. Uh, thanks to Elias Storm once again for providing me with a story. I like it. I truly do. So he has been... Uh, oh, this is not right. So we need to adjust that. Uh, let's do that right now. I don't know if you are aware, but you can import and export your characters into this fantastic mod. Uh, by just going to the options. Um... Never looked at this actually. Well, what's this campaign type thing actually? Uh, we're playing on full realism, and there's one thing, guys, that I've changed. I disabled the charge animation in battle. I want that one on actually. Um, and the players or the enemies now just attack me without too much of. Um, a thing. Uh, this is something you want to keep on. Uh, lack of rest will lower your morale. Yes. Well, you do want to get rested. I don't know if you turn this off. 
uh, your guys will, well, choose to disobey you more directly. But you can do a lot of things here. Turn off the uh, gear effective skills and shit like that. But anyways, we're going to click on more, import, export. Oh, import, export. And uh, Darren Oak, uh, press C. And uh, I already exported him. And I know you're going to hate me for this because he's a very good archer. But uh, not anymore. So this is Darren Oak. Yes. He has a uh, trait, he has entertainment, he has three in persuasion, persuasion, uh, some inventory management, some pathfinding, riding, athletic, he's not a good warrior, but he's a good archer, he truly is. Uh, we need to get him a horse, and then we'll uh, just have him ride with us everywhere, yes. Very, very much of a clarification, anyway, let's go to White Harbor again. I'm going to be trading with the locals. Um, it, it it does help. It does. Because fur here was about a 105 before getting our dad here. So let's get this one in. So we're now full on furs again. There is a tournament. Now before starting. There's been a few comments lately that have been less kind. <laughs> Be gentle on me, okay? We're playing almost at 70% difficulty. If you think you can do a better job, then upload a video to YouTube um, where you are talking to a so-called audience uh, on the same difficulty, and I would love to see that. Uh, but just don't, don't, don't go ruining my day, please. Uh, this is something I'll do for relaxing, and I really need relaxing, especially now. Um, chances are very likely that we have... Oh my god. Uh, with salty house um, okay they are in there that guy over there okay I got one that means that I'm allowed to advance to the next no next stage I wanted to say there you go uh, I'm completely stuck now. Put it in reverse. Put it in front. Leave me alone. <laughs> oh boy. I have no clue of knowing who is mine and who isn't. Anyways, let's place another bat. Let's be frank, guys. We all know I'm not going to be winning this, but fight in the next round. Oh man, you got a horse. Shit, I'm stuck. I am so stuck. Wow. No. Oh. Damn you, Cattleback. He is such a badass. Damn you. You with your mustache and your combed hair. Anyways, we all know we were not going to be making that. Now, what I want to be doing, actually, is now you can see the anti lazing and stuff is all off. It looks like the old mountain blade. I'm actually holding back a sneeze here. So forgive me. Oh my god, I hope I can't. Oh no. Okay, don't sneeze. We got a fair amount of money, but... Um, the party amount that it costs is, is, is really getting quite high. Also, I want you to be an archer at the moment. I've been told that I should have gotten the uh, Northern uh, Warriors. I, I'm, I agree, I should have. I'm sorry for that. I completely messed that one up, but uh, it's fine. So, we are going back towards uh, the Western Lands. Uh, and once we have sold all our furs, uh, we are definitely getting an enterprise. It is... Um, okay. Lord Baelor Greyjoy has crowned himself King of the Iron Islands. Okay, cool. So, the story is progressing rather fast. It's, it's progressing faster than I can do my army. Um, that brings me to the following. 
I am playing on, on quite a difficulty here, you know that. And I should I, I could be a lot further into the game if I didn't. We can do this the easy way. And I was paying attention shit. Okay, leader troops. Oh, this ain't good. Uh everyone here. Okay. Could I please could I please come on archers? Okay here. Infantry plus spearmen go there. Cavalrymen go at the back. Um, what I'm hoping for is that my archers are going to be absolutely destroying these guys. At least I'm hoping there are some archers of them as well. Okay, we need to make sure they are put back in place. I want them to focus on me, so I'm going to ride straight in there. It's not the best decision, but I know, I know we need to do this. And uh, we need to keep on riding as fast as we can. Okay, and I need to have my cavalry go in. No! Wow. Oh, you idiot. You, you idiot, you idiot, you idiot. What have you done? Your cavalry, is they now doing anything? My archers are absolutely doing a good job. Uh, by the looks of it, we are winning this. Come on, don't get killed. Uh, it's all thanks to the archers. We are um, standing a chance here. Uh, if we hadn't, it would definitely be a bad, bad day. Uh, I'm actually feeling of... Uh, also, also, if you have the dead cam, scrolling your mouse wheel will uh, make it faster. Look at this. Uh, so scrolling up, scrolling down, and it will slower the camera. Now, we are definitely winning this. Not thanks to me, although I'm here to disagree. If I didn't charge in the first wave, they all would have clashed into my uh, infantry and that would not have been good so we now won we lost two or three and we've gained renown and morale and I definitely definitely needed morale our father has been taken out and, and, and me as well uh, but he killed I, I've only wounded ah at least he killed one. You see, that, that's why he's our father, right? He's just so much better than we are. Uh, let's get these guys. Darren Oak has been wounded. Uh, let's get the brigades And as much of the bandits as uh, possible. Um, let's take a quick look. Uh, we got a spear here. I don't really want the spear. I was kind of hoping for some better gear, but apparently that is not much going on. Okay, let's go towards the twins. Some units are ready to be upgrading. Let's go to a man at arms. Yeah, we lost two. That's a bit of a shame, but look at this. The morale now is excellent. It only needed like 18 morale. That is something I don't buy. That is something I don't buy. Let's go to fair market. Also, are we wounded? No, we are not. We were learning how to read. Now, can read. No, uh, we need to go back towards all time. All time, because um, we were learning how to read there. Although it did cost us quite a bit. Oh my god, like that. That cost us a bit as well. Now, I don't want to be selling too much, but let's wait here for some time, for the night time to go over. Uh, 
Uh, trade with the locals. Let's take a look. There is some salt here. I don't want to go under 350 actually. There you go. Um, yeah, we will receive 25. That's actually not bad. But you've seen this already and I, I know you're like, oh, come on, dude. I know. But it's the difficulty rating. I know. Let's go to River Run. Uh, we are heading towards um, <clears throat> Lannisport. Uh, definitely with some salt. Eh? Oh my god, look at that. They have 23 and I really want to use as much of that money as possible. That's more than enough actually. Look at that, 3k. There you go. Leave. And we are heading towards Canis. Uh, we are definitely going to be buying ourselves an Enterprise. Now, we are going to let everyone just fight on. It, it's, it's not our fight yet. Eventually we will join. Uh, but what I'm worried about is that we might be a bit too slow and eventually... Like, Nightwalkers are, are invading the north. Uh, and, 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 and wow, that is going to be a very, very difficult time. Let's take a quick look over here. 600, yes, please. You got some salt here? No, you don't. Well, that's fine by me, actually. What I could actually do is buy some butter, some honey, some dried meat. Uh, some fish, cheese, fruit. Yeah, that should be enough. And that gives us the opportunity to sell a bit more. We will. And now let's head over to Lensport and get our very, very first enterprise. Just to help with the wages. Um, trade locals. Look at your guy with your iron. Being all fancy smancy. Uh, we can actually also sell the salt over here. But I don't think they'll have enough money for that. They don't even have enough money for this. Well luckily it's not that much. Let's get this stuff down below. We got some a fair amount of silver. Yes, just pay me whatever. Um, meet the guild master. Productive enterprise. So let's take a quick look. What is the most expensive thing to go on? I'm not going to be looking at uh, what it all makes. But look at this. this. The ale here, the beer, will make you 764. It's costing 14.50. Here's the money. And we are now a business owner. Let's uh, do a little speech for an hour. And we gain some silver stack and two bardic reputation. I have no clue what I can do for you though. Uh, perhaps eventually when you have enough bardic reputation you'll gain more silver? I don't know. I really do not know. Uh, let's get out of first person here. Yeah? Uh, that's a cell sword. Uh, I really want to get like a healer going on. Also what we should take a look at is uh, horses. I said horses not bloody donkeys. Wow, they're actually quite cool. Also, Faction Blacksmith, do you get something new now? No, you didn't? It's a bit of a shame. I was kind of hoping you would now have, you know, some items and stuff. Uh, I really actually want to go to Old Town. I know. I shouldn't. But I'm, I'm going to. Going towards Old Town. Uh, perhaps if we come across a bandit party like these uh, Sea Raiders... That's actually, now is the time to test something out. Okay, at the end of the video. Um, we're going to be saving as episode 9. And, and hopefully this is not going to disrupt the recording. But probably it will.
Okay, I am still recording it seems. So we are now on HDR mode without anti laser And we are leading our trips. Uh, one and four. Go there. Archers, cavalry. Go there. So, what was the comment saying is there is a lot of flickering going on. And that's why I'm, I'm now riding amongst my trips. Is the flickering there? Is it there? Because we are now testing something else. We're going to turn off the HDR mode off and the anti lasing on. And I'm hoping that this is now enough for you to be testing. Let me know what it is. Let me know what it is so I can turn one of the two on. Personally, I would love the HR, uh, the HDR mode on. I really need more infantry. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, damn you, that javelin bloody throwers. I hate javelin throwers. Okay, we are definitely going to be circling around them and hopefully make sure they have no longer got any javelins going on. And we'll have our cavalry charging in now. And let's get this guy in the back. Wow, he didn't die. Man, my weapon proficiency is way too low for this. Are you killing off my kills? Are you doing that, sir? You bloody rich rider. He was mine. You knew that. You knew it from the start. You didn't care, did you? He was mine, I told you. Stop attacking the guys I want to kill. Bastards. Okay, there's one more, uh, but I think he's going to be making it. Oh no, he didn't. Of course there. Ah, Reach Rider, coming in for the kill. So, uh, that was my little test. We, uh, I'm, I'm hoping for some comments. We did get some renown, get some morale. We should be getting, yeah, way more guys in there. Let's uh, level you up to Mountain Sergeant, uh, Sea Raiders. Let's get as many of these as possible. And we are going to get some Northmen. And look at this. Finally, got something okay-ish. I don't like these. Definitely don't like that. But we are increasing our gear. Uh, what I'll do off camera, guys, for you is uh, head over to, um, to Old Town. And once I'm there, I'm going to look for the um, Teach Me Reading thing in the Citadel. And hopefully it doesn't cost me an arm and a leg. Uh, but it probably will be. So anyways, thank you so much for watching. I do hope you enjoyed. Um, if you have enjoyed, then please consider giving the video a quick like. A good rating. Leave me some comments. And subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet. And I'll hope to see you next time. Have a good one. Bye.